Well, hundreds gathered at the Capitol to support those living with PKD. This is a potentially life-threatening kidney condition. As Case Ray 3's Leticia Ordaz reports, a two-year-old boy and his family are sharing their story, not only to raise awareness, but also to help find a cure. Yeah, and my balloon went so high. Meet Preston Kirshner. Just like most toddlers, he's fascinated with balloons and has no idea he's fighting for his life. My son Preston will be three in October. We found out that he had PKD when he was born. Here we go. Today, Team Preston gathered the state capitol to join the effort to find a cure for polycystic kidney disease, or PKD. The reason I walk is to find a cure so that he can grow up healthy and happy and not have to do dialysis. The Karshner family is from my own. They want the world to know about the hereditary illness that leads to large cysts growing on the kidney, affecting how it functions. He seems normal. His cysts are growing bigger, so we expect to have some pain here soon. But as of right now, he just has high blood pressure. Currently, the only options for people like Preston are to get dialysis or a kidney transplant. But walkers here today are hoping to change that. I think that things like this walk are helping with um, awareness of PKD. There are several drugs and clinical trials that the money that we raise here goes to fund research to find a cure for PKD. Larry Ann Austin says five generations in her family are living with PKD, including herself. They're all determined to fight this disease. We're really on the cutting edge of coming up with a treatment. This group of high school students showed their support by raising $1,800 for the cause. It's like a very um, possible disease for anyone to get at any time, but there's like no cure for it and it's like very, and the public is very unaware of it. So I wanted to like raise money for this specific event. Community support is putting a smile on the face of Little Preston and dozens of other families living with this life-threatening condition. We want to end PKD. Hopefully that a cure could be found. At the state capitol, Leticia Ordaz, KCLA 3 News. Quite a turnout. Organizers say they expected to surpass a goal of raising $30,000 to fund research and help those living with PKD. Sacramento joined more than 50 cities nationwide hosting a walk in their community. Good stuff. Yeah.